Hi, and welcome to another session of Nice Label 2019 Tutorials. Today we're going to talk briefly about how to select from our predefined templates that we have in our catalog. So we have a complete list of all of the items that we sell to our customers. We have the predefined dimensions of those into these Nice Label software. So let's get started. Here we're going to go ahead and create a label. And then we're most of the time going to be going to our Toshiba or our uh, Titan printer. So based on what printer you're going to be going to, we select that. And we go in and we do the next key, next button. And here is where we're going to actually define or pick that predefined stock that we're going to be working with. So once we... Um, load settings from the predefined stock. We're going to drop down the top drop down and then scroll down a little bit and pick click on the arrow just out to the left of it and here you can see both for the 4 inch printer, the 5 inch printer, the laser printer, the Solo 4 are all the printers that we currently um, sell to our customers. So and what you see here is a list of all of the products for uh, those printers. So we've got the Toshiba that we've selected in this example, so we're going to be working with the 5 inch printer. So if you're doing uh, what we call tree tags, uh, tree type tags, we basically have put all of those item numbers that you would normally see when you receive the item or on your invoice or on your packing list, you're going to see an item number. Those item numbers correspond to the uh, numbers that you'll see here whenever you select the item you'll be working with. So for example, we've got a OS asterisk 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 05 asterisk asterisk T. What we're looking for in, in the measurements of this is the width and on a 5 inch printer they're more or less um, side by side rather than end by end. So you're going to have maybe four across, five across depending on the width of the tags. And that's what we're going to determine here. So we got a 05 for half inch, 06 for 5 eighths, we've got 07 for 3 quarters, and we've got 10 for 1 inch. So if it's 1 inch wide, 3 quarters wide, 5 eighths wide, or half inch wide. So most of the most common ones is a 1 inch. And you see a representation of that on the right, and you'll actually see the label dimensions that we've chosen was a uh, 5 by 1 inch. We say it's a 5 in, um, inch because you don't, your print path is only 5 inches. Now your opening is uh, 9 inches, so you can have the, the longer label. So once you've selected that, you hit the next. And at this point, it's just going to confirm all the settings that the predefined template has already set up. And again, it's showing us all the predefined functions, and all of those are going to be simple. And we'll say finish. And now you have a representation of the size of the label or tag you're going to be printing. And that concludes our uh, tutorial on how to pick the correct version and a predefined stock for the stock you're going to be printing on.